To help conserve personal protective equipment and reduce contact between hospital staff and patients who have or are suspected of having COVID-19, the radiology department has developed a process of obtaining chest radiographs through glass windows and doors. This allows the radiology technologist to acquire a diagnostic CXR without entering the patient's room. This technique requires the cooperation of the technologist and nurse or other unit staff member. In this instructional video, we'll demonstrate how to perform this new technique. The technologist will remove any extraneous items from the portable to reduce possible cross-contamination and simplify the cleaning process. The technologist will enter the unit wearing the appropriate PPE. There may be a variation in the types of PPE the technologist dons depending on supply issues and current hospital guidelines. The nurse will position the patient on the bed with their head at the top of the bed and their back flat against the bed. The nurse will move the bed close to the glass window. The end of the bed should be perpendicular to the glass. Next, the nurse will lift the head of the bed to 90 degrees and remove the pillow from behind the patient. If present, necklaces and bra should be removed, as well as EKG wires, if appropriate. The technologist will pass a lead shield and the detector with a single bag covering to the nurse through the open doorway. The detector will be placed in landscape orientation with the black side against the patient's back and the top edge of the cassette extending one inch above the patient's shoulders. The patient's back should be flat against the cassette. Next, the technologist will adjust the position and angle of the x-ray machine as needed. The technologist may ask the nurse, through the glass, to adjust the patient position. The technologist will move six feet away from the x-ray machine and give the nurse a hand gesture, such as a thumbs up, to indicate they're ready to take the x-ray. The nurse will move into the corner of the room, ideally six feet from the patient, and position the lead shield between the patient and themselves. The nurse will then give the patient the following breathing instructions. Take a breath in, blow it out. Take another breath in and hold it. The nurse will signal to the technologist when the patient has taken a deep breath. The technologist will also watch the patient's breathing, look for the nurse's cue, and then take the x-ray, after which the technologist will gesture that the image is taken and the nurse can tell the patient to breathe normally. The technologist will evaluate the image on the x-ray machine for diagnostic quality. If the x-ray needs to be repeated, the technologist will communicate any adjustments to the nurse through the glass. If the image is acceptable, the nurse and technologist can begin to clean up. The nurse will remove the detector from behind the patient's back, fold back the covering, careful not to touch the detector directly. The nurse will pass the detector to the technologist through the doorway with sterile technique, keeping the covering inside the patient's room. The technologist will then clean the cassette. Next. The nurse will pass the lead shield to the technologist through the open doorway. The technologist will clean the lead shield, the x-ray machine, and doff PPE as appropriate. Thank you for watching this educational video. Our hope is that through this modified chest radiograph technique, that we can keep our healthcare staff safe and continue to provide high-value patient care at the University of Utah Healthcare System.